South suppression water system is activated. 12, 11, 10. D minus 10, nine, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ignition. ID maneuver PTI, we see the response. It is. And we started the last PTI maneuver, structural mode ID. And we passed T plus one hold, 105 seconds. People's now traveling Mach 4, 20 miles altitude, downrange distance 32 miles. The uh, SRM tail off is observed. Yeah. Our APU is shut down. Yeah. Is shut down. Yeah. Medium fire. And set. We show a set and a tumble motor ignition. Yeah. We can confirm on video. We see uh, both parts of the vehicle tumbling. The uh, first stage as well as the upper stage. Successful separation. Look at that. Clean signal all the way. T plus 150 seconds. We'll have a burnout orbit uh, parameter in just a second. These numbers were calculated right at burnout. The height of apogee 21.92 nautical miles. How big that is. And again, that's not peak altitude because the vehicle was still drifting up, but that is at burnout. Coming up on T plus 190 seconds. It is just launched from vehicle there. Vehicle separation, we have no guidance. Tele telemetry return, we're still looking at good telemetry signal.
bus 80 seconds, we've started our supersonic large amplitude ID maneuver PTI. We see the response. the last PTI maneuver, structural mode ID, and Ow. we passed T plus 105 seconds. People now traveling Mach 4, 20 miles altitude, downrange distance 32 miles. The uh, SRM tail off is observed. Our APUs are shut down, CRDs are shut yeah. down, medium fire. And set. We show a set and a tumble motor ignition. One minute, fifty. One hour, fifty-nine minutes, and twenty-two seconds to launch. I'm here at the Ares rocket, the Ares One X test flight. There it is over there, and it's around. It's three or something foot tall. I, I don't know what it is. Really it huge. Come here. here, I'll put. One hour, okay, there is a sh to shuttle launch. on that one, just so you know. And if you zoom in, you might see it. It's the Ares 1X. Oh, 